just taking a quick look at the Daisy Red Rider air rifle. I decided to order these because I've got a BSA air rifle and it's just too loud for shooting in the garden. The last thing the neighbours want to hear is a bang 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 going off all day. I used to have one of these guns as a kid and uh, getting it back it's very nostalgic. I know it's more of an American thing so I suppose I was one of the lucky ones who managed to uh, have one of these when they were uh, a kid. I know in America they're quite cheap, about $40, well, this cost £40 in England and because of the gun laws and such it cost me an extra £25 when I picked the gun up. So all in all they turned out to be quite expensive. Let's quickly take you over the, uh, the box. Not a toy. Adult supervision required. Misuse or careless use may cause serious injury, particularly to the eye. And that is no joke. I would definitely recommend wearing some goggles, glasses. It's very easy to get a ricochet if you haven't got a good target set up. And maybe dangerous up to 178 metres. You're never going to shoot that far. I'd say about 20 metres you might be able to hit something. Maybe 25. 350 feet per second. I have saw on the internet with people using the chronographs that they run anywhere between 260 to 300. It's plenty powerful enough for putting holes in tin cans. Lever cocking. Shoots 177 BBs. So here's the, here's the gun. I remember the gun that I had as a child. It had a metal lever. I don't know if you can see it now because it's quite dark. But it's now a plastic lever. It's plenty shrunk enough. I did email Daisy about replacement levers because I know in America you can order them for a few dollars but um, I got a reply back. And... Um, they don't ship anything to the UK, so once you've got this gun, you've th that is it. There's no chance of getting any different parts or anything to fix it. It does come with a, a little leather a little leather toggle on the uh, side here but I've replaced it with a piece of paracord I know people say that it gets in the way but I've put this on here just to distinguish the two rifles from each other because this one has been I've probably shot about 3000 BBs through this one and the one in the background hasn't took so much use yet but that's all for now I might do a video shooting shooting the gun sometime if that's uh, something that you're interested in. So let me know.